going everybody it's your boy big country coming to another game of satisfactory and yeah it's still a mess out here still a mess but i think it's time we work towards getting the space elevator up and get our first uh delivery done so to do that we have got to connect let's see we got the screws and the plates working for um the heavy plates and we got the uh, screws and the pipes running can make rotors this is not e very efficient though it's very slow it's not doing a lot and also we're running out of screws faster than we can produce them because we have to use them in two different ways but that's not working out good we'll run out very soon but I think we have enough rotors to where we can make what we need for this I don't really know why I didn't even check that why this is here I only need 50 of those and this is like acting like I need a buku I, I don't know we're gonna set it up and hope it it's a little quicker for us so first things first is we got to get our we're gonna put it right here our simulator right here there Don't want that one. We want the faster moving ones if we can help it. Bear belt two. Plates is what it's telling us. Because we want this to be speedy. I don't want that one. I just said I don't want that one. Oh. Boop. Beautiful. And. Oh. Boop. Beautiful. Pull our plates back. Oh. And then we need to hook it up. Where's my hookup point? There it is. Boom. Alright. That'll start processing, but now we need a place to store everything. Come on. Storage container. I need 10 plates. Alright. Easy. Okay. I need to put this on three. This is what I'm using now. Right. Oh. And we're making mark plating. And this takes a long freaking time. And we gotta have 50. It takes forever. Two parts per minute. Hope that's more than one. No, it's one. Two per minute, two per minute. We gotta wait on that. We have to have 50 of those to launch our first set. We have all that going. I'm gonna go check out our terminal. See if there's anything else we can do. That's gonna end quickly. Take a look. So all these are complete. We're waiting on to finish this base elevator phase one. 
complete. We get two. We'll get two once we complete this one. So that that'll be worthwhile at least. But yeah, it's gonna take a minute. It's gonna take a hot minute. Just running from over here back to over there. I think I'm I'm only gonna have like three. Three. But I can I can show y'all how it works. Come over here. Start right here. So you know the whole point of the mining turns both of these into iron ingots. Both iron ingots. We got cable, and we got the plating, and we got the screws. Now the screws are made by the iron ingot over there turning into pipes, then turning into screws that gives us our three uh, phase one components right here we then run the plates and the screws into this one which will give us reinforced plates once we get enough screws because of how slow it is and then the pipes come into here and we the screws are actually split with a splitter so one there and going this way this is one of the reasons we're losing so many screws so fast and this makes the rotor. Once both of those are being made, I let them stockpile up a little bit and we're already out. And I sent these over here. Once they get to this assimilator, they make the plates. And this is going to be close because I don't know if I have enough rotors or not. Very, it's very inefficient. But in time, we're going to be able to do it. Now, I'm stacking a lot of concrete. The reason for it is, is you need concrete for foundations and so forth. If we're going to do these type of foundations, we're going to need a lot of stuff. Also, the walls. A concrete and plates. So, it's all a work in progress. Once we unlock enough, we're going to shut the whole production down just about. Except for the bare minimum. So these assimilators won't be running for either of this. We just want the bare essentials right away. So all you'll see running is going to be the screws, the plates, and the poles. You'll see the concrete continue to be brought in. And you'll see both copper and the, um, the coil or cable will be brought up as well so we'll be shutting down anything from those assimilators assimilators will start to be shut down that'll help us save some money not money some energy but it looks like we're full on cable yes yeah, so we need to go shut some stuff down So we can shut this down and save our fuel right now. Alright. Why is this not moving anymore? This is finishing up the last little bit it can. All right, this is still moving. All right. This should go until it backs up. And then that should be done. Those still have a ways to go, but it is a stack of 500 for them. So it's got a little ways left to go. And I'm actually going to put another... Um, if this fills up before we're ready to start building, I'm just going to add... The next part of the splitter, which is going to be on the right side or the left side, how we're facing now, and it's going to come to the right side here, and we'll have three filling up. I didn't want to do it right off the bat because it just seemed like a waste of material and energy to do all that. And plus, it takes so long for the concrete to get here because we had to go way over there. So, everything is working as it should, even though it looks like it's not. 
It's just we don't have the power and we don't have the force to complete right now. That's going to take a little bit. Let's go send off the base elevator. I wonder if I just automatically get everything or if I have to wait for it to come back. And how long does that take? Because it's getting to the point now where that little rocket goes for seven minutes sometimes. Fill it. All right. And send. Okay, that's cool. That is cool. There's no time though. Why is there no time limit? What is that? Versatile frame rate. Automated wiring. More smart plating. I can barely make what I got. Okay, well, let's go see what we can unlock. Hopefully we can unlock some Mac Mark II um, things. Oh, I didn't forget about this either. How many rotors do we need to unlock this thing? Because I would like to see what's in this ship. We need 21 rotors. Okay, well, let's see how many we got. Because I ain't going to be 21 yet. Looks like it's still working. Five. And like, like I said before, we got plates coming, but the rotors just, I mean, look, it's just so slow. The rotors are just slow. And from what I understand, I think we're, yeah, we're running out of our plates faster than we can make those as well. We just need, we need two screws being made. One is just not going to keep up, but that's okay. We will re-engineer this whole place. All right. Coal power. Coal power. Yes. Oh, yes. What is that? Pipeline pump. Fluid buffer can contain water extractor. What the heck do I need water for? Pipeline port. Pipeline junk. What do I need water for? Oh yeah, we got a tractor and a truck station. Um, boundary, smelt two resources into alloy ingots so we can make a new type of alloy. Steel, steel, we have, we'll make steel with two different types of alloy. Steel beams, steel pipes, all right. I need some building stuff though. Let's, let's just start here. Oh, there it is, Miner Mark II. We can mine stuff quicker now. Normal extraction rate is 120 resources per minute. Perfect. Um, heavy modular frames. Yada yada yada. Ya. Motor. A Xeno Basher. Heavy electroshock self defense weapon from melee range. Oh. Oh. Victory slots. Hand slot. Another hand slot. Stackable hyper tube support. Mm. Hyper tube support the hyper tube. What the heck is the hyper tube? Support the hyper tube to allow for longer distances. Tube for transporting visit employees. Really? You used to enter and and power a hyper tube. Really? What else we got? Um, we got some industrial storage containers. Contain 48 slots of storing large amounts of item. Has two inputs and output for conveyors. Hmm. There's a double storage. We can make faster, 
belt. I hate to see what that's going to cost me. Bear lift. Stackable pipeline support. Alright, it looks like we need to get our... We need to get the coal and the vehicle transport up and running. And then after that, we can move on. But that's going to take rotors. Damn. Hmm. We're gonna have to revamp everything. Yeah, we're gonna have to revamp everything, so I am gonna get at that. And then next time we'll be able to actually knock out some of this because this is getting out of hand now. Let's get up here. Let's take a look at everything one more time before I move on. Because everything's gonna be different when y'all come back. Yep. All of this. And I'm getting rid of that stupid present. But all of this is going to be changed. Alright, well I hope y'all enjoyed. And I will see y'all next time. Later!